that pig still wasn't beautiful. Hmm. Oh, then he got an idea. He decided to go inside into his mother's closet, and he found his mom's beautiful red taffeta skirt. And it had some elastic in it, and he thought that would fit the pig. So he went outside, and he put that uh, right around that pig's waist. And he took a look back, and he was like, hmm, something's missing. Ah, he had a great idea. You know what he did? He went across the street to his Aunt Margarita's house, and he went to her closet, and he found a blouse. He knew it would fit because, you know, the size of his Aunt Margarita, he thought it, it would fit just so. So he put that blouse on that pig, and then you know what he did next? He took a bright red wig, just like this one, and he put it on that pig's head. Can I put this on you? All right. Let me see your face. All right. So he put that bright wig, bright red wig on that pig, and then he thought, oh, he went a little farther. High heel shoes? Yes. Well, he put those high heels on that pig's trotters and he stood back and he took a look. He thought that was the prettiest pig he had ever seen. He thought his mom would be proud of him because remember, his mom said, make the pig look beautiful so when you take her to market, you will get the best price ever. Close your eyes. Good. So when he. Go ahead, you can tell me. You with the pink. I think it ran into it and splashed around. Exactly. Juan Bobo's pig forgot that she wasn't in charge, that Juan Bobo was supposed to be in charge. So that pig jumped in that mud puddle, and it rolled around a few times, and it felt, it, that mud puddle felt so good to that pig. It rolled around so much air. Those town people laughed, and they laughed, and they laughed. They thought that was the funniest thing they had ever seen. They left Juan Bobo and his pig right out of town. So in Puerto Rico today, when anyone gets dressed up so much that their friends and family almost don't recognize them, almost, but they'll still recognize them, and they did just a little bit too much on their makeup and their accessories, they said, you are dressed up just like Juan Bobo's pig. And that's the end of that. <laughs> Thank you very much. Give her a round of applause for being so great.